So a few months ago, a guy called Travis Goodspeed made a talk at a hacking convention, and the topic of his talk was actually this radio here, the TYT MD380. What he managed to do was he managed to decrypt the firmware, and he managed to get the radio to accept custom firmwares. So now anyone can modify the firmware for this radio and change it. So the first hacked firmware is available and I've installed it on this radio and basically what it allows you to do is listen in to group calls even if they're not programmed into the radio already. So if you haven't got the group in your group list you can still listen in anyway and it also allows you to listen in to private calls. So I'm going to demonstrate that now. If I bring up a random group on this radio here. Okay, so if I use this group here, for example, 277, that's not programmed into this radio, but I'm going to key up on it and it should come up on here. So let's try it. Yep, there we go. So it's coming up on this radio. And that group is not programmed into the TYT at all. And let's try it with another one just to prove that it's not programmed in. There we go. We're talking on this group as well. And even another one. Test 1, 2, 3. So it comes up as the default contact, which is why it showed contact 1 on your screen, or on the screen, instead of the actual group number. The other really neat feature is the private calls which I'm going to show you in a moment. Okay, so I've got this radio's contact up and I'm going to private call it. There we go. So the private call's gone through. This radio's receiving it. You can see it on the screen there. And this radio is also receiving it, even though it doesn't have the same ID. So now let me just talk back on the other radio, just to demonstrate it definitely doesn't have the same ID. So there we go. I've keyed up on this radio. And this radio is receiving it now. And it's also coming up on this radio as well. So there you go. Um, the new firmware can listen in to private calls and group calls that you haven't programmed in. So that's it, that's the demonstration of the TYT MD380 working on group calls and private calls. If you want to listen to the talk by Travis Goodspeed, I'll put a link in the description so you can go and check it out. Thanks for watching.